Hello, my name is Sean Robinson, and this is my proposed research. How is the rule of law experienced by black people in the United States? Hello, my name is Sean Robinson, and this is my proposed research. How is the rule of law experienced by black people in the United States? In this short presentation on how the rule of law is experienced by black people, myself, Sean Robinson, as your narrator, will go through a few slides. First, the topic introduction, research questions, the hypothesis, methods, implications. And I hope you enjoy. The topic of this research proposal is about the rule of law as it relates to Black people. Historically, the criminal justice system has shown evidence of being unjust to Black people. For example, slavery, Jim Crow, segregation, redlining, etc. The proposed research would examine the experience Black people have had in modern days with the law. The gap in research on this topic is the mere proof of failing to look at the experience that Black people have had in the criminal justice system. Now, while there are plenty of studies on the topic of racial disparities in the U.S. justice system, none of them address how the rule of law is experienced by Black people. The hypothesis of this proposed research is strictly based on literature review. Also, cases in recent news. Black people do not, hypothesis one, sorry, jumping the gun. Black people do not normally receive justice when killed by a white officer. We can refer to cases like Breonna Taylor, Mike Brown, and uh, Trayvon Martin, and even go back 25 years ago and refer to cases like the Rodney King case. All right, that's hypothesis one. Hypothesis two, the experience black people have within the US criminal justice system is perceived by black people as harsher than their white counterparts who commit similar crimes. Hypothesis three, criminal justice officials use their discretion to hold black people accountable for crimes at a much higher rate than they do white people. Uh, hypothesis four, black people receive harsher sentences and serve longer times in prison. Hypothesis five, white people have a higher probability of being released after arrest than black people for committing the same or similar type of crime. Method. 
of this proposed research, collect data that include jail prison records, inmate surveys, crimes committed, charges and convictions by race, chart data to illustrate the differences in treatment between black and white people, um, which really speaks to the experience of um, the rule of law by black people. Conduct a survey that will gather information about the experience black people have had with the law. This research will lend itself as a resource to communication professionals and criminal justice scholars who have an interest in finding solutions to racial disparities in the U.S. legal system. The data will show the number of arrests, convictions, and sentencings among Black and white people in specific cities in the U.S. The findings of this proposed research would offer evidence to legislators who are working to make laws fair. Without this data, one could not see Black people's experience through the lens of Black people, nor have any way of telling the truth about Black people's experience as it relates to the rule of law. This Mwah. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for listening to my proposed research presentation on how Black people experience the rule of law in the U.S. My name is Sean Robinson, and I hope you have a fantastic day.